with the PDP getting set to hold its presidential rally in the state tomorrow, a founding father of the party has expressed concern over the plight of the party in the state. Dixon Imasugi, who is a national leader of the party, also took a swipe at the national chairman of the party, Iyochi Ayu, for not following due process in addressing the crisis rocking the Edo State chapter. Recall that the party in the state has since been split into two factions due to the internal crisis between the governor, Gadwin Obasaki, and the national vice chairman, South South, Dan Obi. I led members or will be members of PDP to Abuja in 1998 to register this party. Since then, I have not moved an inch on this party. The party is now divided almost to two in Edo State. The original owners are the ones who claim to be the legacy. Those who join us, who left us before and came back through Obasaki, are those in charge of the government. We don't know what is happening in the government. But I'm not at night. As of today, the legacy candidates for Senate are the one approved by them. As of today, the legacy candidate for House of Rep are the one in the list. But you saw them all parading about that they are the candidate. Are they respecting me the law? We don't have a candidate. You will hold are you responsible? Our supposed national chairman is the one manipulating the National Working Committee. Assuming he followed the Electoral Act, cooperated with INEC, all these things will not happen. INEC and the National Working Committee are part on who the candidate is. But we are on the side of the INEC because we did the right thing. Yes, I'm aware the working committee took a decision that they are backing out from their arrangement. They didn't tell me, but when I read it, when I came from the farm, I took side with them. If myself, the father of PDP in the two states today, as I than later Nene, cannot fit in to the campaign structure of PDP. What are we talking of? Who are those who drew that list? Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.